in my snow boots. And which snow boots are yours? The little ones with hair in it. The little, the little ones with hair in it. The fuzz. They're furry. You and see this kid? He came in my room this morning and he said, "Mom, can you buy me snow boots?" Those, He's, like those are fine. those are Olivia's. <laughs> um, what color of snow boots did you want? Red. He goes. Can I get red snow boots? Yeah, I want red snow boots, yeah. Okay, you ready, Freddy? Let's go. Yeah! Here, let me find my shoes. Tell them what we're doing. Going to church. This morning when I told the kids we're going to clean the church, Boston's like, it's always clean. And of course it's always clean because families like us No, he are said, he said, why do, we have to, why do we have to clean it? It's always clean. It's always clean, yeah, yeah. Anyway. It's so, clean because families are volunteered to go clean, and it is our family's turn to go clean the church this week. Is anybody else going to be there? I don't know. What's that? Yeah. Why do you buy slippers? Oh. Okay, come on, bud. Yeah, hurry. Hurry, hurry, hurry. What? Look how pretty the mountain is. Oh, those mountains are pretty. Well, that really is pretty. It finally just like picked it up. Super pretty. Where's he going? I'm gonna He's go gonna run. run. Oh. He's gonna run there. Fine, we'll have it done by the time you get there. Okay, run. Um, bye, bud. He wants to run everywhere because he's training. Training. We don't know what he's training for. <laughs> I don't think he knows what he's training for. I don't think he knows what he's training for. But he's training. Religious cult training, I don't know. Oh <laughs> my gosh. <laughs> we call it music party. Music party, that's a good one. <laughs> Clean the church music party. <laughs> Boy, gonna get up on the piano and jam out. <laughs> I'd break a nail at this point. <laughs> I'll tell you, hey, what, oh. Well, you know, I don't care if he's not in his seatbelt. We're going around the corner, and I don't care if people yell at me for it, and we're leaving this in. I don't care. Okay. Boston, what does Cody do every morning? He's running his brother. <laughs> uh, he does his weights. Yep, you guys, the weights that Santa brought him. <laughs> See you, little boy. The weights that Santa Claus brought him, <gasps> he gets up and he uses them every morning. And you're up front with me, and that's okay. I don't care. We're literally going around the corner. But accidents can happen around the corner. Yep, yeah, they can. And this is what we're doing. That's we're my problem. Not yours. Going to follow. It's the cops. Oh, how? Lincoln, get down. The cops are coming. Lincoln, get down. No. Get down. The cops are coming. Boston, are you down? No. no. Oh. It's not. Are the they cops. pulling you over, Joel? It's just a black car. If kids are in the front, we go to jail. <laughs> Just kidding, there's no there's no cops behind us, Lincoln. <laughs> Look at his face, that was so he was like his face was like just the entire time was like so funny. <laughs> Oh that's rich. Okay. One time my cousin Marshall, he was driving all of us and he was flooring it. I mean this was super reckless and irresponsible, but he was like flooring it on the freeway and like like zooming in and out of lanes. Okay, we were at, no we actually weren't on the freeway, we were on a back highway, that's what it was. And um, he was like, the cops are coming and so we, me and all my cousins got down on the ground and we were so scared for the way he was driving. So I always think of that. I do. Oh, cool. Well. <laughs> you made it. You made it. Are you going to be too tired to clean? Okay. There's nothing to clean. Because it's so clean. It is so clean. And you know what? We're going to clean the clean. That's what's going to happen. That's what we're going to do. See, look. Lincoln's creating... Lincoln's creating... Um, He's, no, he's creating crumbs. We're going to vacuum Lincoln's crumbs. Can I go get that No, we're not playing with the balls on the stage. Okay, Bon, your assignment 
We'll get the kids on the garbages. Ooh. Your assignment is to vacuum this room. The Relief Society room has to look nice, but it has to look nice, Bonnie. Like, everybody's gonna see our name on this, that we did it. And if it doesn't look nice, I'll be like, that's Bonnie Griffiths is holding it's fault. I'm very distracted right now. I'm distracted. You're working it. All right. There's a lever here somewhere. There we go. Uh -huh. Have fun. Don't break it now. I'm going to have you start vacuuming this area out here. Okay. This big foyer area. Foyer. And you got to go in here too. So when you're ready, just pull the cord underneath and it'll fit. And we'll vacuum that area, okay? Lincoln, you just stay by my side. You two are going to be in charge of garbages. Let's go get that and take care of it. Come on. That's forever. And watch as the native <laughs> Mrs. Holine cleans the church in her primitive state. You can tell that she's in her relaxed state because she's wearing her husband's pants and probably her husband's top. Mm. What a majestic beast. You guys are going to take this big garbage can and push it, it'll wheel, and you're going to take it down by all the classrooms mm -hmm. and you don't pull the bags out of the trash cans, you just dump them in and then set the garbage can with the trash bag back, okay? All the little ones that are in your classrooms, okay? Then when you guys are done, come find me. Don't, don't run around, okay? How are we gonna get this downstairs? I'll help you when you're ready to go to the stairs. Go to the room mom's working in first, okay? That's hardly the fast way. Giggles worth. Bathroom garbages? Yeah. Oh, okay, Cody, I'm gonna show you the part you're not gonna like. This is the one part we have to clean out. <gasps> hey, there's no poopy diapers. Poop. I'll do this side. You do that side. Boston, you do this side, okay? Mom, can I do a side too? Oh. Go get that garbage put away. Let's Boston, go. Get, get, get off of that. Dad. Come, Come on. Get in the car. I'll put that in the garbage. I do not want you to hit your head. Oh, I got it. You got it? Here, I'll hold the lid. If I eat. Okay, come on. Eat shiz. All right. Cody. Okay, get in. <laughs> the, the ice was fun. Yeah. Cody, the ice was fun. He got Did hurt. you hit your head on it? Yeah. Aww, I, like, I okay. ran. I, it looks so much like water, but once you run on it, you slip. Yeah. But it oh, my window is up. Whoops. We're down. Summer. Okay, so what's the plan, Stan? Okay. <laughs> the park? Um, is the plan the park? Eat something. Eat yeah. cream of wheat. No, we're not eating cream of wheat. Um, we're gonna go home and get everybody's gonna get Sit down, dressed please. in normal civilian clothes. Whatever. I'm in normal clothes. I'm in normal clothes. Okay. I gotta go Closet. help Josh with the task. Okay. okay. What are you gonna do? Daddy. Let's go to Ellie and Jared. Guess what my teacher said? No making candy boxes. Put it all in your backpack. Are you joking me? Yes. His teacher does not allow arts and crafts. Cody, that's she 
That's ridiculous. Classy, you're making a bag. And the other, yeah, you're classy, gonna make a bag right now. Classy, the other classy. And I'm gonna go to the teacher and be like, my mom said that we can bring a box if we want. Okay, I usually, I always give their teachers the benefit of the doubt. His teacher is so lame. They didn't do, she didn't let them do ornament. What was that? I, it was an accident from my childhood. Okay? Hey, guess what? Ornament. All At Christmas the classes time. makes arts, like, all the like, classes make art crafts. It makes me a little sad. But Cody, if that's what your teacher says, that's what you have to do. So do you know what you can do? Mm -hmm. Make a Valentine bag or box, keep it at home, and then when you bring your stuff home from school, you can put them in your Valentine Mom, bag. Mom, maybe no, uh-uh, because I have to say something. You have to do what your teacher says. Yep. If you don't like her, if you don't respect her, you show her respect and you do what she tells you. Okay. Whether you like it or not. Okay? okay. So That's called respecting authority. adult authority. Yes, it's called respecting your authority. Um. And that is a crucial lesson that most kids I don't feel are learning. Respect your teachers. They work hard for you. They you may not okay, this is actually very important. You might not like your teacher. You might not agree with your teacher. But she's the teacher. But she's your teacher and you're going to listen to her. Yeah. Same with your parents. Do you like what I tell you a lot of times? Nope. Am I mean? No. Yeah. No, no, no. I'm not mean. Can I answer? <laughs> oh, thank you. Mom, mom, get but, but you respect me because I'm your mom. But so whether you like your parents or not, listen to your parents. Show them the respect that they even may not deserve, but they are the parent you are the child, and when you move out, you can do things differently. Your teacher is your teacher. When you move on to a different class, <laughs> then you can do things differently. Hey, Mom. That's a really good lesson that I think most kids don't learn. I don't so. feel like I was taught. This is the first time I'm hearing this. Do you or no, oh, you learned it. Your mom told the teacher. <laughs> she literally gave the teacher permission to smack me if it was necessary. My teachers would be like, oh, that's funny. My mom would be like, no, I'm, What's funny about I'm it? I'm dead serious. <laughs> like, punch him right upside the head. I don't care. Just make sure Joel's just toe in the line. Yeah, and guess what? You're one of the best men. Well, you are the best man on this planet that I know. So. Oh, uh, what about your boys? Congratulations, Mrs. What about Helene. your boys? Mom, me, gosh. Wait, I'm Mrs. Helene. I'm Wait. confused. I'm confused. Wait, bad news and bad news. Let's hear it. One, I made a, car, a Valentine's card for my teacher. Right, right where I left it, it's gone. We'll find it. What's the other bad news? The other bad news is that Cody farted. Okay. I didn't do it! He came and said, Bear! Bear! Okay, let's go, let's go. It's a bear! Joel, are we calling it a vlog? Lincoln, where is Lincoln? Lincoln! Lincoln, Roy, that cop's coming for you. I just saw a cop over there. Just do you have snow in your mouth? Spit it out. Spit it out. Spit it out. What's in your mouth? Spit it out. Water from the church? Water from the snow? Water from my truck. Water from the truck? I have a water bottle in there. Oh, I was like thinking he was sucking on the rail. Yeah, I was like, oh gosh. All right, we're calling it a vlog. Thank you guys for watching. We're calling it a fart vlog. A fart vlog.